Hi and welcome, it's Paul again from Inside Paul's Brain with some more Web 2.0 questions and answers. I was going to just answer one question each day and then move on to something different, but many of you have been asking this one question, how do I drive traffic to my sites? You've asked it in different ways, but that's always been the bottom line. You want traffic, and I think it's good, I think it's great that you appreciate that traffic is what matters. Because whether you're using AdSense, Paper Lead, Paper Click, whether you're selling ClickBank products, whether you're selling your own products, it's only the traffic that really matters. If you're converting at 100%, but you've only got one visit a month, you're not going to be earning a lot of money. So um, I thought I'd do something else on driving traffic to your sites. Yesterday we discussed social bookmarking, um, and I showed you a free way to um, sign up and start social bookmarking. There are tools out there. You can quite happily spend 97 bucks. I can tell you a few if you want, but I thought I'd show you a free one yesterday. Now, today's idea is a free again, okay? Something a little bit different, um, still relatively young, and there are a few different ways of using it, which I'll mention. Stumble upon, okay? stumbleupon.com there you go just go to that Earl and I was really intrigued when I found this um, saw it mentioned on a forum and it's got a lot of stuff going for it it's a toolbar which you can install on Firefox or Internet Explorer nice and easy to install very easy to install okay it's got as I said, it works with IE or Firefox. It's got no spyware, no adware, nothing dodgy going on in the background, for want of a better word. So how do you use it? Well, you vote for a site. It has a little thumbs up or a thumbs down, and you vote for a site. Now, how can this help you? One of the things we stumble upon is you can stumble a site, and that means they will show you a site they recommend. When you join up, you list your site, and that goes into their database, and it will get shown to various people. Okay, so once you're a Stumble member, and you've got the toolbar up there, you can visit your sites and give them the thumbs up, as you naturally would, put a little description in, and off you go. Okay. There are some other uses for it. I know I said I'd be discussing driving traffic, and I've heard of people driving some very nice traffic to sites with StumbleUpon. Obviously, if you're only promoting one site at a time, or two sites, or three sites, or half a dozen, then it's quite easy. If you're, some of you are probably going to be saying, well, that's great, Paul, but I promote. I build 50 sites a day, how the heck do I promote them? If you're building 50 sites a day, you're probably using a blog farm. So, stumble the blog farm. Okay, and get some visits to that, and hopefully they'll filter down to your other sites. But if you're only promoting one or two sites at a time, whether they be squeaky clean or not quite so white hat, stumble upon will get you some good traffic. The other use for it is you can buy traffic. Um, it's five cents a visitor, I believe. Now, if you're selling a product, then this could be quite a good way of testing your sales page. You can buy some visitors at five cents a time, um, put a hundred through or something, and, and just test your sales page and see if you get any comments, you get any sales, that sort of thing. But I also found it useful for ideas. I sit there and once in a while stumble through a few different sites, see if I find anything interesting, um, get your mind working a little bit. So you install StumbleUpon at home, and the toolbar works great. But obviously, you can't keep on voting your own site every single day. So. Get your wife to install it at work, or your husband. Not sexist, don't know who works at home, who works in the office. Now, obviously, they're on a different IP address, 
So get them just, you know, do a different site, one a day. When they start work, just ask them to stumble toolbar, go to one of your sites and stumble it. What about if you've got three or four friends and you're on a private forum, maybe? Well, can you all stumble each other's sites? To get it more noticed? Because I think they operate a voting system. It, it makes sense to me. If you're voting for a site, surely the site with the most votes gets displayed more. Um, don't know if this is a fact. I'm just throwing something out there. Does anybody know if that's the case or not? What do you think? Makes sense to me. Stumble upon is free, easy to install, and easy to use. Okay? It can drive your traffic. It can give you ideas. This is what Web 2.0 is all about. It's viral, you know, because you tell your friend about it and they install it and just it. That's how it's expanding. Um, I came upon it through uh, a forum. Somebody mentioned it on there. There are some great ways, but don't always just look at the obvious. I want you to start looking beyond what it's actually designed for. Um, one of my tools, Comment Hut, somebody was telling me how they use it not only to leave comments and promote their website, but they're also finding niches within their own niche. Um, so they're actually building more sites out of the information they're gathering. So today's question and answer is, once again, how do I drive traffic? Today's answer is stumbleupon.com. Go and take a look. Make sure you come back tomorrow because I'll have something new for you. Please, if you've got any questions or com comments, leave them for me. I do honestly love to hear what you've got to say.